Michael Chalavelle, another Frenchman on the Seattle roster. And with Chris Wilcox, there he got caught up in the air. Montez there to bail him out. Wheeling into Barnes. What a delivery by Ellis. Baron going up. He finds Monte. Wheels there and finds a lot of trouble and congestion, and then he finds Matt Barnes. Monte on Ridenauer. Right to the rim to lay it in. Earl Watson, you've got Durant, you've got Green. You can't play defense like that in an out of bounds play. Monte got the layup. It's almost impossible to reel a player like that in. Barron stealing the inbound. Darren Davis all the way to the rim. And at some point, you got to make someone in Seattle uniform make a jump shot. Jackson inside, putting it up and in and drawing the foul. He grows around green, no problem. Going in Seattle, you need still made a jumper yet. Jackson. Steven Jackson finally found a little opening. Shot clock off. Final second. Barron down the lane with the left hand. They'll count it. Even shooting 41%. You be the judge at home. Watch those orange lights. Not the clock. That's an easy one. And another slow start defensively has allowed Seattle and Kevin Durant to run wild in the first 12 minutes. C.J. Watson gave up his body for that steal, and Barnes laying it up and in. Petrus can't wait too long here. Just make a little move to that right in there and deliver. Petrus and cover the basket. Nice up and under. Petrus beating his man and the bigger one inside. <laughs> Working on Durant, a slicing Petrus and putting it up and in. C.J. Watson. Time out on the floor, 7.46 remaining in the half. And the Warriors down three. That means more turnovers than assists tonight. He's got four assists, one turnover. One turnover. Pardon. You know, he's, as you said, you can't dunk everything. He's got yeah. a little more clever inside. Absolutely. How about this last attempt by Durant? Met at the apex by Brandon Wright. That's length and a little bit more length. Grab a rebound. And Durant sent away by Wright. Continuing to play with his double-digit lead. Barron with a nifty scoop shot inside. That's a tough shot. Rose play good defense on Ridden now. What awareness of the shot clock and knew Luke was going to shoot it. And Monte it is just remarkable. Over and over and over. Again, he forays to the rim. Also 14. Good defense on Rittenauer there. So the Warriors coming up with stops after that timeout. Ellis from the baseline. Yes, sir. Barrett is getting to the rim and the paint area consistently tonight. Monte, a little crossover. And Ridenauer, not a strong defender. And Baron Davis, again, bringing multiple defenders into the middle because of the penetration. And forcing Ridenauer left. He's not as comfortable going left. If he goes left, he usually passes the ball. He was forced into a shot last time. Marquette to put it on the floor. Now Green, switch there. Harrington knocking it away. Shot clock at three. Green just checked it. He knows. That's spinning. And the Warriors are playing some D. Now they're playing some defense. And even worse from three-point range. One of nine. Warriors will still get the last shot of the half. Grant having it knocked away. Barron with a steal. Ahead to Monte. He'll track it down. Find Jackson. Lay it in. Did a great 
job protecting the ball. First of all, beautiful hands by Barron, and then the awareness to throw it down. The ball gets away a little bit from Monte, so he knows the only way to get the score is to throw it over to Steven. Austin Crozier with 12 minutes off the bench, 10 points and three rebounds, and has provided a spark. He's been extremely active, makes himself available, and has a nose for being around the ball. You may say he picks up little garbage points in there, and you might interpret them as hustle points. And he's done a terrific job for him. He's brought back a little electricity this team needed, a little ignition. And now trying to stay with Monte. Over driving. The play up and in. Nice drive. Season best games for Crozier. Barron coming up with a steal. Barron in on Rittenauer. He'll miss, but there's Monte to clean it up. Barron's got six steals in the ball game. Monte on the steal. Monte in a foot race. I'll let you guess who wins that one. Put back no. He gets the rebound. Chance for the Warriors to run. Aliou. Peters didn't catch it. And Crozier cleans it up. This is the Warriors' biggest lead, an 8 0 run. They move up by five. And, and the Sonics are not good in that department at all. They commit 16 a night. And that puts them at 28 in the lead. And Baron Davis with the three. The boss is starting to feel it. Got a good look in, in preseason. Thought he was going to play more. Moving the ball. Monte moving to the rim. Hanging and finishing. But that foot could have been planted on that face, and that would not have been good. Baron another steal. Baron alley -oop. Monte with the finish. They had eye contact. That eye contact. And Monte. That's had to duck his head below the iron there. How about Monte Ellis? On this alley-oop, how high can you get? He's dunking, and then, whoa, I'm going to get out of there. Now, the Ohan Petro, they also have Sine, and they also have Robert Swift. They have three young seven-footers. He trips to the rim, and Mike laying it up and in. <laughs> it sure seemed like it. The Warrior, Warriors set the NBA record. Richard steps into that one, and there it goes. Well, that's been the story of the Warriors this year. A crazy roller coaster ride, but when they go down, they usually come back up. I mean, take, 57 percent from beyond the arc. Yeah, not taking many, but he can shoot the ball. Harrington had rip now running out, and that had to feel good for Al. Only difference is I didn't go off two feet. I had to get a running start. Yeah, Al's ready to come out of it. Makes that one, comes right back with this one. Saw an opening, and he got high in the air. Dallas, a nice delivery, and Petrus blocked his countryman. And Monte finishing again. They, they've defended, they've rebounded, they have run it down Seattle's throat, they have forced turnovers, they've gotten scoring from a number of players. They just look like themselves again. Petrus double, Jackson from deep. has been here in the second half. The problem with McGrady is he's very fragile himself, and how long has it been since he's played a complete season, if ever? Jackson with a clever delivery for Durant. If the Warriors hold Seattle under 100, that will extend the longest streak in the league as the Warriors are undefeated in holding opponents under 100. I the Warriors scored 100 or more in 19 straight games. What a night for Austin Crozier, 14 points in 20 minutes. He, he was the key. He brought the Warriors back to life and then got help from Monte. He just with the shot clock at three. Crozier, a new 24. Peters reloading there. And Petrus, the steal. 
Roundtable Live at 7. And Austin Crozier, this is what veterans are supposed to do. Part of our Fries Electronics HD defining moment of the game. 14 third quarter points for Austin Crozier. And he brought the energy and electricity back to the club. I think they started feeding off him. Just had a terrific game, and it's good to see him out there and contribute like that.